Hi, this is Mimi, born to sparkle and shine. So, I'm at a Home Depot, and I'm looking at stuff, and I picked up a couple things. I want to try about to grow dill. We'll figure out what that happens and how it tastes, and probably we'll have to name the dill. Kind of wandering around. It's getting hot. It's, you know, quarantine time, whatever, isolation time. So I have on a mask, and I'm getting hotter and hotter, and there's lots of people there without mask on, whatever. I, um... I'm walking around the store and we um, are about to leave. Luckily, we'd have to wait in line in the heat like we did the last few times we've been there where you stand outside in the heat and only like certain people are allowed in, certain people allowed out. So anyway, so I'm, I'm at the register and I know this happens to other people, not just me. This cannot be just me. And so I'm at the register and this plant says to me, Hey, lady! I know you can hear me. I know you can hear me. You gotta take me home. This plant, this plant, this plant started talking to me, to me, talking to me. This plant was talking to me. I don't need medical, mental health care. I promise. I, anyway, this plant, this plant that says on it, nine, nine ninety eight, nine ninety eight for this plant. And I'm thinking, I am not paying. 998 for this freaking plant that is in this condition like I just left the store less than an hour ago This is the condition the plant was in at the store at the store. This plant was in this condition This plant does not have a name yet or a gender I don't even know. I don't even know what kind of plant this is it Alocasia Alocasia, I don't know what that is. I always call this. I don't know what this is this plant It's talking to me at the register so I'm at the register, and I'm like, oh my god, I hope I picked the nice girl. So then you've got two choices. You gotta, you're waiting in line. You have to pick, you know, the one on the right, the one on the left. Well, the one on the right's fumbling around with this woman, and her, she drops her plant, and the plant, the dirt comes out of the plant. I'm like, oh, we're not picking the one on the right. And Shelly's like, what are you doing with that plant? <laughs> I'm buying this plant. And I'm like, but we're going to see if I can't wink my way out of this. I always say, wink my way out of it. So I'm trying to buy this plant, and this plant is nine ten dollar plant. It's a ten dollar plant, which I mean, it's like dead. It's there's one green thought of peace of life in this plant. And it's calling my name, like hi, light up, soldier. Hi, tired. I need help. I've, I've got to, I've got to take this plant home. Um. Anyway, so I walk up to the girl and I go, "How much would you charge for this plant?" She's like, "You want to buy that plant?" And I was like. Yes, but I'm not paying ten dollars for this plant, and I'm thinking she's gonna say half off, and I'm thinking I'll shoot five dollars. I'd hand five dollars to people, anybody who asked me, especially a kid who had like a lemonade stand or something, so I can buy this plant for five dollars. And I'm like, um, yeah, I'm buying this plant. Like I'm not leaving without this. Plant. There's got to be an mental health care issue as I think about it. I'm not trying to be just mean to people with any like problems. This, maybe this is a level of hoarding I don't know about. I don't have, like, a plant issue, though. Like, I have, you know, a few plants. I don't have, like, enough plants to be, like, a, oh, they're a plant hoarder. Um, I have, like, one plant in the house, and, like, there's plants outside, and I'm growing some, like, food. Like, you know, you know, whatever. But this is, like, a dead plant that I'm dying to buy. I gotta buy this plant, because it's calling my name. It was at the register, like, waiting for me. Like, I don't, I don't need this plant. But I couldn't leave the plant, and I know that this plant will come up with a name at some point. And like Harold over there, or Luna Lovegood. Luna Lovegood's doing really well. She is doing really well because I put her in the dirt, so she's very happy in the dirt. Um, but the this plant, and not all my plants get names. This is I'm no, not all my plants get names. An update on the lizard. The lizard we saw this the lizard from yesterday that was dying in my car was actually like running around back here. It's still looking skinny and pitiful, but you know, it lived at least. I put it in the, I put it in Luna Lovegood, the lavender, and it, it, it survived the night. So, as my stepson said, or my son said, um, it's going to be somebody else's meal because it's so pitiful looking. So, anyway, this is the plant that I bought. So, on to the rest of the story. So, the girl looks at me and she goes, what if I charge you a dollar? I'll discount the plant. What if I charge you a dollar for the plant? I said, sure, I'll take it for a dollar. Buying this damn dying plant for a dollar. Um... So I got the plant. I got to figure out what to do with it. I haven't even watered it yet. I haven't had a moment because we then went to the other, another store and I'm like, oh, my plant's in the car. I can't get my plant. 
the, you know, too dry and too, and like it's not half dead. So there will be an update on this plant, I'm sure, because I will have to show you pictures of how well it's done and its future and all that kind of good stuff. But here is the plant. Still needs, if you have any suggestions on names for the plant, I will take those suggestions because this plant, it needs something. It needs love. It needs a name. It needs me to talk to it. It needs some water and probably some good fertilizer. Yeah. This is Mimi Born to Sparkle and Shine. And I apparently have a problem talking to lizards as of yesterday and a plant as of today. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Share me on other social media. Hit like if you like this video. Comment down below. I need a name for this plant. I really do need a name for this plant. And no, I did not pay $10 up. But yeah, I need a name for this plant. I don't know what even what this kind of plant. I need to Google what the plant should look like. That probably would be a good start. What should this plant look like? I know all it needs is water attention, but what should it look like so I can kind of see what its future will be because I got to speak into the future what this plant's future will look like. So have a wonderful evening. Wash your hands, use hand sanitizer, get some rest, and I hope you enjoyed this video. Bye-bye.